Hey you guys, welcome to Ham Radio with K0PIR. And in my last video I was using RumLogNG and WSJTX. And there's a real neat feature in RumLog that will start the FT8 transmission for you. Uh, so if it detects a DX station out there that you need, it will start the transmission right away for you. And it works great. It's really cool. And I was going along logging contacts and... Uh, you know, I wasn't getting the name in QTH in there because I was logging right from WSJTX into RumLogNG. Now, when it was showing the call sign up here and I was making the transmission, the name in QTH, that showed up here. But when I logged it using WSJTX, it left this information out, the name in QTH. And you may want that in your log. So to add it after the fact... Uh, just find the ones. I've got some FT8 contacts in here without the name in QTH. I'm just going to select them. I, I use the shift key and hold it down and left click. Select a bunch of them and then go up to QSO and add QSO data. And I use uh, QRZ sometimes so I'll just pull that up. And there you go, it pulls the information from QRZ. Now I just want to make sure that the grid square, squares are the same because uh, one of these guys may have been traveling. Here's one, uh, KI5QYY. For some reason I didn't get his grid square. So I'm going to let it go ahead and overwrite and put it in there. Uh, so if I, let's, let's go down. Uh, EL, yep, CM, yep. Uh, then that one and EM and EN and EM33, uh, that one's different. The EM33, I want to remember that because I don't want to overwrite with this grid square. I don't want to do that, so I'm going to select the rest of them. Hold down the shift key, select those, and uh, go ahead and overwrite the existing data. And there you go, it puts it in there. So now my log looks a little bit more complete. I like having the name in QTH, but a lot of times I don't, uh, I don't wait or do it manually to put it in there. So that's how you can get it in your log uh, if you want the name in QTH in there. So there you go. I hope you find this informative and useful. Uh, I know you could look around forever trying to figure out how to get these names and QTHs in here. <laughs> it's, so, it's so simple. Uh, QSO and then add QSO data. Help me to reach 10,000 subscribers. Please remember to like, subscribe, and share. Tell your friends. 73 and good DX.